So are you guys actually answering questions mm -hmm. in your interviews? Where's the audio? Oh. Do you need a clapper? Probably. Good thing you're not our shooter, bro. <laughs> I know. Uh, you know, we have some fun stuff around the office. I haven't even heard them play music lately or play games or even talk to each other. They're just working all the time. That's what I like. Accordions are very uh, precious to me. My Yiddish ancestors would make boots in their boot making store. Tap dancing started with boot dancing. Now, my ancestors were Yiddish, so they called it Bachhtafa. When I'm playing the accordion and the tap dancing is happening, it's like I'm in, I, it's like I'm in the Congo. It's like I'm surrounded by spider monkeys. When the field mice were protected, they started eating all the leather in my Yiddish family's boot store. So in protest, they would play their accordions and dance with their hard leather boots. And it's important in science to get an exact replica of what's going to happen in the wild. They would try to uh, catch the field mice this way by stomping on them with the boots. Hey, you spider monkey, uh, dance for me. They love it, you know, just little taps. I mean, they are just working extra hours. They're just, their nose is to the grindstone. I'm definitely influenced by the early work of, um, you know, they're, they're coming in early, staying late. When I play the drums, I'm usually envisioning flocks of birds. Holy cow. We have 200, 200 fans. 200 fans? 200 people like me. Two weeks off and on playing drums, um, I, it led me to the guitar, which I had been playing for a number of years. I'm part of your roots. I'm your ancestor. I've been to the continent of the East. I've never had too many people like me for anything. I used to play basketball. When I play the guitar, I don't envision flocks of birds as you know, playing the drums. I, I envision rafts and giraffes. Would you guys at least shut the door? I don't know how any work gets done around here. Why do people like me? I really don't know. I think it's the beard. Sometime between the first and second week of playing the drums, I started the Rafts for Giraffes Foundation which provides rafts for giraffes, as well as a number of other things, such as twine for raft building. You know, this, this could be an art form. This could be something that I could do. Determination, hard work, determination will get you 200 fans on the Facebook machine. We've been moving towards uh, inflatable rafts. Um, they just seem a little more high tech. The 
music that wells up deep inside and oozes from your internal organs is the music of life. And how, how do you think the giraffes and music can come together to make the world a better place? Oh. It's, it's already happening. <laughs>